Oh my gosh, I don't know if you all saw the panel, but like, that I started, I almost had to like be like, what is that onion smell? I'm not crying, you're crying. <laughs> like, I had to literally fight tears because it started to be a real Yeah, even right, I can't think of it right now because I'm just start falling a little bit. But um, it's definitely coming to fruition and I'm definitely starting to feel it. The more and the more we talk about it, the more I see, you know, all these guys. Um, in the back of my head, it's just like, after this, I might not see them for a while. So it's, it's a sad thing. When you look back at the show, this crazy, insane show, what's your overall feelings thinking about what it's been through and how it's evolved? Um, it's, I don't know if I'd call it the little show that I could, but I just remember in the beginning, um, and just in the first season, I'm just like, are people, it's so weird. You know, there's so many like weird jokes and so many weird things that we do. The characters are weird. I'm like, are people gonna get it? And like, we're just like, we had fun. That's all we could really do. And to see what it's become, to see the little kids that come up to us that just are like smiling ear to ear. The, the parents that are thankful to us because they get to watch a show with their kids and not having to worry about, you know, seeing blood and violence or like, um, any of that uh, R-rated stuff, it's it's very special. Um, and it's, uh, it's something that I'll definitely remember for the rest of my life. And yeah, it's, um, it's an incredible experience. And hopefully, I don't know, somehow we'll get together again and make something out of it. Who knows? Ten years down the road. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what, are you, what are you going to miss the most uh, playing your character? Um, I just to do a metaphor, I guess, on this whole it's like it's, the whole show or the scenes are almost like a basketball game. And it's like a lot of the times I get to get the ball and do a slam dunk, a, a lot of the times I get to you know say the joke. Um, and although that is a lot of pressure, I do get a huge kick out of trying to make my castmates laugh, um, cry, laughing. Um, <laughs> So that, I think that's the biggest thing, the fact that we just get to fool around and and always I always try to break them as much as I can and I think that's the biggest thing with me, being able to laugh at these things. What's next after this for you? Are you wanting, to, the last question. Into, are you wanting to roll into other television projects or you want to take a risk? I think, yeah, I mean, as, as much as I love Jason, like, um, and he's always going to be in my heart, like, I'm going to, I really want to just emphasize other Roles. Like we have Taco coming out, and we have hopefully other projects kind of in the works right now. But I mean, before all this, it was all drunk for me. Like, this is my first comedy thing. So maybe dive back into that a little bit, and then come back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.